Joseph Waweru on Quora recently asked, does an address matter when somebody applies for a green card? If you'd like an answer to that question, then stick around. My name is Damian DeNoble, and I'm an attorney at Bull City Lawyer in Durham, North Carolina. Welcome to Bull City Lawyer TV. On our channel, we help immigrants and entrepreneurs go further, faster, when interacting with regulators and the legal system. By doing that, we hope to close the service gap, which leaves 80% of those people who need legal help and services without them because they either can't access them or they can't afford them. If that sounds good to you, then consider subscribing and commenting below on our channel as that helps us know that we're doing a good job and something worthwhile. Hi, I'm Trent Williams. I'm also an attorney here at Bull City Lawyer, but today I'll be playing the part of Joseph Waveru. And my question is, does an address number matter when somebody is applying for a green card? Joseph, Joseph, that's a great question. And it's an overlooked question, frankly, because a lot of people think that that part of any immigration application, whether it's a green card or you're applying for something like DACA or you're applying for something like a U visa, which can be very sensitive, is just a gimme. It's not a gimme. And depending on the situation, in your case, the green card, you really kind of have to look at it closely, okay? For you, since you're applying for the green card, it is very important, and there's usually very little risk, although I don't wanna tell you that there's no risk or little risk in your case because I haven't spoken to you, okay, and I haven't evaluated you. But here's why, in general, uh, your address field is very important, why it's very important to, for it to be accurate. Number one, this is where all of your documents uh, when you're interacting with USCIS are going to go to this address. So you wanna make sure that you can access it. If you can't access your documents, you cannot get through the green card process. Number two, this goes to your credibility. So whenever you have a green card interview or whenever an officer's examining your case, one of the key things they look at is your address history. And if where you are currently doesn't line up with what you've said on the papers, if you tell the truth and say this doesn't line up, that hurts you. If you lie about it, that hurts you. And so you wanna make sure that that address is accurate. My final thought is don't let this question sit. Go talk to somebody, talk to multiple people. As soon as you have some clarity, you have a path to a solution. Hey Joseph, I hope what Damien said was helpful, answered your question. For other core users, if you have any questions, head over to Trent Wesley Williams or Damien DeNoble and ask us a question. The link's in the bottom. If you like this video, then consider subscribing to our YouTube channel, consider commenting, consider sharing with your friends as we really, really appreciate it and it lets us know we're doing a great job.